Several weeks after satellite images revealed Iran has made a big indigenous missile launching catamaran vessel, it was finally unveiled by the IRGC forces in the port city of Bandar Abbas near Hormuz Strait in the Persian Gulf. Hello everyone, I'm Shafi, welcome to the new episode of Polit Affairs. This one was really shocking, even for myself. I did not expect Iranian engineers to make a powerful beauty like this. The new patrol combat vessel is named after Iran's late top commander and is equipped with a stealth hull with a very low radar cross section and is capable of carrying out different operations. It can also carry different types of high-speed military watercrafts and allows helicopters to take off from and land on its deck. This vessel is Iran's first ever military ship equipped with vertical launching as well as short and medium range air defense systems. Propelled by four powerful homegrown engines, the vessel can sail under unfavorable climate conditions and is highly maneuverable with a very low turning radius. It is also equipped with modern systems for surface, subsurface and aerial tracking and monitoring, target detection, signals intelligence, telecommunication and electronic warfare. In another ceremony in the same city on Sunday, the Navy of Iranian Army took delivery of two missile launching vessels, a logistical warship and a Qadir class submarine. Speaking at a gathering of Iranian Navy, Major General Mohammad Baghiri, the Chief of General Staff of the Armed Forces said, Our country is at the height of oppressive sanctions, both from the financial point of view and from technological point of view. In these difficult conditions, the youth relying on local knowledge were able to build new vessels, missiles, drones, weapons and equipment in the field of defense, as well as renovating and rebuilding the complex equipment of the past and make it operational again. This is a very valuable and great work and we appreciate the efforts of each and every of you and everyone involved in the matter. Iran was focused on manufacturing long-range ballistic missiles for years and they were able to accomplish it. Then they turned to drones and they were able to manufacture advanced drones to the point that Russia as a military superpower has purchased drones from Iran. In recent years, we have also seen robust attitudes from Iranian officials to improve their maritime security power by unveiling a few indigenous warships, speedboats, catamarans, a submarine, and even drone carrier ships. The turning point in all these efforts is that they have all been manufactured locally without any foreign help or technology. However, Iranian-made weapons are not on par with American or Western rivals. But this is becoming a reality that Iran is already a huge military power and will be able to become a huge arms exporter too. What do you think about it? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out other videos on my channel and also to share your opinion with me in the comments.